Today, MEPs reiterated their call for binding legislation on waste reduction and a clear strategy to build a path towards a circular economy. A high-level conference, as well as a showcase, have been held in the Parliament in order to promote a new lease of life for products. Europe has to go to a new business model and that uh, means uh, not to create waste uh, and uh, waste raw materials but to reuse, remanufacture and repair. A circular economy would not only protect our environment, it would also provide social incentives. Circular economy creates a lot of opportunities for new jobs. And um, there are sophisticated jobs, but there are as well normal, simple jobs. And uh, looking in the unemployment rate we have in Europe, uh, there are opportunities for both, for engineers as well as for workers. Staff members and visitors of the European Parliament were invited to bring their broken devices to the showcase to get them repaired for free. At the showcase, technicians expressed their wish for the regulation of the electronics market. Nous venons ici un petit peu démontrer, plaider un peu notre cause pour dire voilà, s'il était plus facile à un moment donné d'avoir des pièces qui n'avaient que des composants simples à remplacer, on aurait plus facile à les remplacer, on pourrait les remettre dans le circuit plus facilement à des prix plus abordables. As repairing electronic devices requires very specific knowledge. It offers an opportunity to citizens struggling to enter the jobs market. On prend des gens qui euh, ont des difficultés passagères ou parfois de long, de longue date et qu'on essaie de remettre dans une direction positive vers l'emploi. Une fois les appareils réparés, on les remet dans le circuit et donc on fait un recyclage des appareils vers les gens qui n'ont pas les moyens pour acheter du matériel neuf, mais néanmoins nous donnons une garantie de six mois. An initiative which demonstrates the social, economic and environmental potential of a circular economy across Europe. MEPs now urge the Commission to set ambitious targets on product policy, including in the landfill and food sectors, and therefore enable a life cycle economy to grow and develop in the European Union.